Nice and slow, so DJ turn these lights on low. Come and meet me on a dance floor. It's like something nice and slow. What's up, y'all? Welcome to the motherfucking After This Audio Podcast, and we back with another motherfucking episode. And I appreciate y'all for letting us come to your beautiful homes this Thursday night at 8 p.m. And if you are not here with us at the premiere, then I appreciate you for tapping in at any time that you've been tapped in, because baby, you already know the vibes we hit in the motherfucking Audio, baby. You know what I'm saying? All right, so anyway, it go. I already spoke. You already know how I am, because obviously if you live in your house, I ain't got to ring the doorbell. We friends now. I can just walk on in your house. But I did bring guests. Every time I come, I know y'all tired of me putting up with people. But I don't like come places nowhere alone, you know, because I be bored. So I invited these little niggas right here to come on with me. So don't be rude. Make sure y'all speak when y'all come to their house. And don't be acting like a hoodlum, okay? Just act like, you know, professional. <laughs> professional. Show me a professional introduction. Give it to me. Professional. <laughs> yeah. Kyron Norwood. Oh, like you're actually like that's like this not fucking. What is your name? It's like a hello today. My name like it was like oh, lit. professional. Come on. Hey, how y'all doing today? My name is Kyron Norwood, owner of Spade Clothing. How's it going? My name is Tyler Jackson from Houston, Texas, co-owner of Spade Clothing. All right, now give me y'all turned up one. Hey, what's good, man? It's your boy T, man, from the West Side, A Leaf, Texas. Mm-hmm. You already know what's up. Follow me on Instagram. Hell yeah. From Westside. Y'all, like, y'all already know how I feel about people that's from A-Leaf. Hey, ask about Everybody you. Everybody claim A-Leaf. Know who I am, man. Every, that's why you reposted it. I didn't give you a okay, and I get it. He's another one. <laughs> Come All on, right. man. Hey, check in there. Cotton from Berg. You feel me? Mississippi. Had his bird Mississippi in the building. Yo, 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 yo. Check <laughs> in, man. Me from Pearland, Texas. Yeah. <laughs> But anyways, y'all, but like I always got to take a motherfucking shot, so go ahead and grab your little Lamaritas, whatever you got at the house. You know, your four locos, do what you got to do, go take a shot. Y'all, Karen is pregnant, so he's not going to be taking shots of this, but he's going to be our bartender, though, for sure. Okay? And we got Tori behind the camera, so if you hear laughing and things like that, it's for the fucking Tori and shit like that. Uh, you not drinking the Hennessy? Nah, you brought Hennessy. Bring Hennessy it back. Bring just... it back. Bring it back. Bring it back. Drink a motherfucking Hennessy. Oh drink a motherfucking Hennessy. You going to drink tequila, though. Yeah, cool. Thank you, baby. You're welcome. We don't waste liquor. Nah, we we're gonna waste it. He's gonna take it eventually for sure. We're gonna we're gonna have to t- Okay, so yeah, we're gonna mix on this episode. So I'm gonna take tequila one, he's gonna take a Hennessy. So every other one, we're gonna switch the bottle. That's a bit. All right. You got a cup? Just a cup or something, my nigga. You get something? Crank it, bitch. I got it. All right, anyways. You gonna drink with them? You rude. Niggas don't know how to drink them all. Niggas, niggas want to clean their good <laughs> soul and shit. All right, anyways, y'all. So we're going to tap and clink with y'all. It's going to be a good episode, y'all. Uh, you know, this not, this, these are my friends, y'all. So you know, when I have my friends on the motherfucking show, it'll be a whole different energy, y'all. I'll be having my phone with them, so. But well. All right. So take a motherfucking shot. Clink these motherfuckers. Tap the motherfucking thing. Whatever you can tap it on. Oh, I ain't got no chaser with you. <laughs> Not the chaser. You need the chaser. Don't you like the pineapple juice? The chaser. Yeah. yeah. Man, what's the matter? Niggas are not thinking she didn't even be talking. <laughs> Niggas with no money should never have. <laughs> All right, take my drink. Put that down over there for the game. All right. Get you loaded back up. Well, it's a motherfucking good year. We are, you know, approaching all different types of seasons and shit like that. But what we're mostly approaching is a hot ass season in motherfucking Houston, okay? And I know you live in Mississippi, so I don't know if you're gonna have a summer in Houston or not, but. Oh, well, yeah, most you definitely. Have a summer in Houston, yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> all right, so what is one thing y'all looking forward to for the summer, right? Like, what y'all trying to, like, tap into for the summer? Like, man, we no trying school, to... nothing, like summertime vibes. Honestly, man, we just finna really be getting spayed on the map, like, all over the place. It's definitely. the definitely brand. Like, Houston. I was definitely getting spayed out here in Houston, uh, interacting with more uh, club promoters, uh, females, for sure, because I feel like the females tap into your business way more than dudes. Yeah, they'd them. rather spend some yeah. money. Boys be broke as hell. Yeah, I was trying to, like, free clothes your way into some pussy. 
Nah, nah, I never. Hey, baby girl, I got a shirt for you. You tried to like, nah, you want to be a model for my clothes? I done had pussy. girls try to try to fuck come to for me, some. yeah, for some clothes. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How they be approaching you? They be like, what they be saying? I mean, Role play, go. Um, Sing. Your turn. <laughs> go. <laughs> All right, babe, I got you. Hey, I see your clothing brand. You're doing pretty good. You got, you forgot to add you. They be like, your little clothing brand. Oh yeah, the, yeah. your little clothing brand looking good. I've been seeing you guys making posts. I'm trying to see if I can get one and then I can model for y'all or. You know, put it on Instagram or whatever. And they come with for the free. For the no, free. we're not gonna mess with you we're for the free. Mess. <laughs> <laughs> Where's your wristband? No, no for real. Where's your money, bitch. <laughs> all right, so cool. So speaking of all that shit, right? So when I used to have a club line back in the day, right? I used to have motherfuckers just be like, "Oh, I want to be an ambassador for your shit. I want, I want to, uh, you know, me helping you can help me helping you will give you publicity, right? You just give me free shit, right? Facts. So how do y'all deal with motherfuckers that be kind of like, oh, for, uh, just me being your chair, me wearing your clothes, it's free um, motherfucking promo? Did you just believe that shit, Dollar? Nah. Nah, I never believed that, and I always used to tell him that nah, because, he, he right. um, like, I know the difference between somebody who really want to be invested in my business and somebody who not, you feel me? Nah, yeah. Like, if I feel like you can't do nothing for my business, then I won't allow you to. Especially the people who be thinking because they got over 10,000 followers or something on Instagram, like, they The ball followers? Yeah. Yeah. No, some people be having real followers, but shit, that's just motherfuckers. Do y'all know how to tell the people got fake followers? Hell yeah. Okay, so what I be doing is I go to like people, I don't give a fuck. I go to people likes to see, because sometimes I be wondering like, damn, how the fuck that's popping like this? I go to their likes and they be motherfucking Leslie Chow and motherfucking Jackie Chan yeah, and bites. motherfucking RuPaul and them bitches and shit. And they be motherfucking like, they don't even follow you. They be you having like 25,000 followers and be having 200 likes. Like, 200 likes yeah, and shit. Sure. I get more likes than you. Like, yeah, like it was just like, it was just, yeah, you're going to be petty. Okay, so anyway. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. so it's, okay, so there's nothing, right? So this is how I feel about Instagram, right? I feel like Instagram, people like really, Instagram is a resume, right? But one thing I really stand on 10 toes is I hate people, I don't know if y'all got that, I'm sorry. I hate people that turn off their likes on Instagram. Like when they be like, likes by one person and this many likes, like it don't say the number. I feel like if you turn the likes off on Instagram, you think you ugly. Nah, I turn my likes off. Nah, he, his Why? Likes off. It, be low, it give me low self esteem. It uh, give nah, me like you. It give me like you. It me like you really want. So you want you don't want everybody to know I mean, that shit. I mean, I post pictures for me. Like, you no, know I got your likes off. I mean, nah, bro, like, be posting pictures like twelve o'clock at night. Just, yeah, just yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't. Yeah, so I don't. why your likes off? Care. I don't. Know, I don't I just know. turn them off. Like. I personally, I post. I know what time to post my shit. Your likes off? Nah, my shit on. Yeah, my shit on too. I really just don't care. Like, but do it still tell you how many likes you got? Uh yeah, I can go through my stuff he and can see, see with account. my insights. Yeah. So you be checking. So you do care about the Instagram because you. If you I mean, I don't really. Yourself, I, really, I, I really don't insights. care. I really don't I mean, check them like that. But sh- certain like, shit, like if I'm posting something and I'll be like, damn, I'm clean today. Oh, I'm this this fit clean. This shit better for sure. But if motherfuckers, I get a hundred something. Well, hell no. Nah. If, if I get like in, under two hundred or under two fifty, oh that shit again. Nah, that shit if gone, anything, the lie. main thing. Wait, you I can turn your likes off for certain posts. No, nah, I'm saying like I would delete the picture. Picture. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, damn. <laughs> that <laughs> bitch got go. The, the main thing I really check is who send my posts out. Facts. Who send like, my Okay, let's talk about that. This is what pissed me off. People be sending though, motherfucking me. posts out and shit like that. I hear y'all be like, oh, what y'all be saying? What y'all be saying? Bitch, it's only a story, bitch. Your friends reposted your yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. No one is DMing your shit. And maybe like two people out of that group DMing your shit, but no one's saying shit. The least they probably saying is, bitch, look at these shoes. They're cute. Nobody really saying nigga shit. Oh, y'all really be having y'all group messages. It's 38 people that repost. No, your fucking shit, bunk quiche ass friends reposted you, bitch. Relax. No, like, I ain't gonna lie. I will send a picture of, some, of a motherfucker that look retarded and be like, Kyle, what the fuck is this? I don't do that. I send people stories. That too, I'm quick to send your story to somebody. But nah, yo, post like, I'd be like, what made you post this shit? Like the fit or the shoes? Like, what so, the fuck is this? I feel like this. I was talking to somebody the other day, right? Do y'all feel like babies can be ugly? Fucking right. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking right. We just, I just seen one with a lopsided. Okay, so wait, real quick, before we jump into that, before we jump into that, why is it bad to say babies are ugly? Because I feel like this, right? I asked this girl, I was on live, I was on Instagram live, y'all, and make sure you tap into my Instagram live on my live, motherfuckers. Okay, but I was on Instagram live with this girl who had a baby right now. I asked the first question I asked her, I was like, honest to God, when you grabbed your baby, the first thing in your head, would you try to see if your baby was ugly or cute? And I feel like that's a real nigga question. Like, when y'all have children, right? The first thing when you I'm grab like, your baby, you're not gonna be one like, let me see the motherfucker. Like, say, God damn. Like if you Shit. if you grab your baby, you're like your baby kinda ugly. Like what you gonna say? Damn. I hope you good at sports. Huh? I hope you or she good at sports. Yeah, Cause ain't be nobody gonna like something. you. They don't make shit. They can be a show. Some attraction some way. Yeah, you gotta Okay, so how is okay, so like do you think parents be knowing like when they child like damn? Fucking right. Fucking yeah. right. Like damn. Like, they be knowing, yeah, they're not dumb. Definitely. Like damn. Especially nowadays, cause you know what I'm saying, a lot of people be having their kids kinda earlier, more than mm-hmm. like nowadays, so they know. They be like, okay, my kid not like probably not gonna be the one that people like, 
Fuck them. But shit, you know what I'm saying? You, gonna, you gotta find an avenue for your kid. Like, okay, so I feel like this, right? So I really feel like everybody's child is not gonna be there. You know, beauty standards. We have beauty standards in the world. We have GQ magazine. We have Essence magazine. We have Jet magazine. We all know what beauty looks like, right? But I feel like this, right? So if you had a child, honest as a parent, right? How would you raise your child if you know your child felt like, because you know your child, your, if your child, if your child not, you know, if your child, you know what I'm saying? Your child will get bullied, okay? You just know, embrace yourself. When your child getting bullied at school, right, for certain things, like say if your child like kind of big or your child like she gay, if your child anything that just gets bullied, the category of bully, right? How you gonna handle your child? Like, what's your advice for your child to get bullied, right? Like, you gonna tell your child beat their ass? I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna tell beat that yeah, ass. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I ain't like. I ain't raising no turn cheek ass child. I say, you can't be no hoe, man. Like, I'm not a hoe, so shit. My kid can't be no hoe. For sure. So shit, you got to step up and represent yourself. Like, they talking about you, man. Shut they stupid ass. Yeah, I can't stand that. Ignore them. Why? <laughs> no, I hear yeah, them. Nah. <laughs> I, I, I can't nah, ignore I, what I hear. I understand that. Like sometimes, like it's not worth it. All the time, it ain't worth it. But not nah, some lame ass shit. Ignore this shit. But bitch, if a bitch in your face, like, like, oh, I got a good question for y'all. If a bitch in your motherfucking face really disrespecting you, like, bitch, whoop that ass. Yeah, for yeah, sure. For like, sure. fuck all that. Oh, I they didn't hit me first. Whoop, hit them first. Then Fast. get the hardest lick Fast. in, knock I, them off their feet. I don't agree with. But we don't bullying. promote violence. We promote protecting your name. Nah, for shit, sure. show. Yeah, yeah, I don't agree with bullying because I'm when I was young, my mama had. Six kids. Did you ever bully people? No, nah, I never bullied I nobody. But bully. bully my mama had six kids, and she used to drive a station wagon, a yellow station wagon. And you know, we all get in the station wagon, and they would call it the yellow school bus. Uh, like, damn. like, and it used to get to me sometimes. I'm like, damn, like, <laughs> it this really look like a school bus, like. <laughs> Wait, what's a station wagon? That's like a little Scooby Doo van. It's like a Volkswagen. Oh my van. god! Like a bug. Like what Scooby Doo? Nah, on? it's not like a bug, <laughs> but you know it. It got like it ain't a, a bug because it's a wagon. So I don't know. How, how many? How many? How many? How many kids you say? Six. All y'all in one van. Well, it's not a van. It's a wagon. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hell. Wait, is a wagon I mean, like wagon wagon like? No roof? Nah, I got a roof. No, <laughs> Dude. No. Oh, I'm about to say, y'all in a wagon But like, I got bro, bullied, though. I'm not even going to lie. Like, I'm, I'm about to ask, say, y'all got bullied. I got bullied. Well, you got bullied for that, I guess, right? Yeah, I got yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not really bullying. I got bullied. Nah, like, it's bullying. Nah, 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 but that's bullying, you feel me? It that is bullying, feel though. bad sometimes. You Cause feel bad sometimes. Because you're I'm like, I'm damn, like. Okay, yeah. yeah. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, I, I would have bullied you. You started in a station wagon? Nah. Nah, that's an old school station wagon, though. Let me see. It's like an older version of this, like an oh. old, old version, like a 2001. Justin Family Vacation, XL. Uh, Damn. Yeah. Like a okay. 2001. So. I'm in the trunk going to school. Damn. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> 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 I know. I mean, it's not like trying to be serious with my like, like, that's wow. real shit. I, like, you, I mean, that's just a struggle. Like, my mama had six kids. Should I have to walk to school? So somebody yeah. had to open it. No laughing. I mean, you're good now. Wait, somebody had to open the trunk for you? <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, I just crawled through. Feel I feel it, though. Shit, shit. I'll tell my story after TJ. So, why you got bullied? Uh, shit. You I don't know. Big? Nah, I don't know. I ain't gonna lie. Like, nigga, so what did they, you, some, if you got bullied, what did they bully some, that bothered you? How do you not know? The niggas was just bitch me. I wasn't really a fighter at first. Oh, you was a punk. Oh, my mama. You was a pussy. Yeah. You was a bitch. Okay, okay. chill out, girl. Uh, <laughs> I was trying to see you. Nah, but nah, for shit, I wasn't the type of nigga to start nothing. But I had realized how big I was, and then I had realized I was good at sports. And then one day a nigga had pushed me, that had bullied me the year before, and I just beat the fuck out of him. And I had said, oh, It was like God. an anger beater? Like, you had enough? Oh, my mama. Oh, yeah. You should have jail. From that point on, shit, I had realized, like, nigga, you, you big, nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? You ain't no bitch-ass nigga. So, I don't want my child to be a bully, right? But I do want my child, like, if you, baby, I don't care if it's the first time you heard a bitch say something, pop the hoe. Okay, stop. Can your child beat up girls? If you had a son? This is what my daddy told me. The first lick, go tell somebody. Mm -hmm. The second lick, you You ain't gonna tell nobody the first rent. lick. No, no, the first oh, lick you tell her. Hey, stop playing no, with No, nah, you bitch. tell somebody. Cause you know what I'm saying? You need other motherfuckers to know, especially like in growing like in grade school, some shit. If a girl hits you, you go tell somebody. The second time you still tell somebody. But that third one, you beat her ass like she a man. That's what my daddy told me. Not like a man. Like Maybe a man. Just beat her ass, not no, a man. beat that bitch. The ass. first thing I feel like I'ma warn you, sis. I never thought about telling somebody that's never been in my speech. First thing I'm gonna tell you, sis. Second lick, I'm gonna give you one more. No, the first thing I said, I'm gonna take that hoe. I'm gonna just take the hoe and I'm oh. gonna try to leave. Oh. oh. The second lick, I'm gonna let you know, girl, look, you ain't got one more lick in you. That third lick, bitch, I'm sorry. I told you. Like, why? Oh, I'm looking down on nah, her. No, for sure. Knock that hoe out. Like, I, don't th I don't think I'll beat her up unless, like, she's not beat her up, but I'm finna. Why about? 
I'm gonna be yeah. her ass. But you know she's gonna come it, back it, swinging. She gotta get really like, she be gotta be ass. really like flushing me for me to be. Okay, we talking about a bitch flushing you. I'm gonna beat oh, that yeah. Like she ass. in your shit. Like, my, my, my. I'm gonna beat that bitch ass. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> I got like a lot, of, got I got in a lot of sisters. Like, <laughs> yeah, Cud got a lot of sisters. I got a lot so, like, of sisters. No, we ain't got time for that. They hoe, wop, wop, wop. I ain't gonna lie. I don't give a fuck. I'm not finna call her right, right, little sisters, all that shit, bitch. <laughs> bitch, bitch, I don't give a fuck. I gotta tap that ass now, because, bitch, at this point, by the time I ain't call my sister, who's to tell she's not 45 minutes away? Right. I'm, I'm, I, not this hoe at home. I wouldn't punch her, though. I'd probably, you feel me, restrain her. I'm like, a only everyday sh- gentleman, cute. I'm an only child. I slam her. I slam her for sure. I wouldn't punch I'm a, it though. I'm an only child. Boy. A nigga get, I, boy was like getting tired of this girl pushing me. I seen it in school and he got tired of it. So he, he slammed her? He just dumped her on her head. No, that's he true. Man. I, 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 yeah, that's I the probably, only thing I do. I wouldn't no, hit her though. Not the head. Not, no, I'm going to show you something for shit, y'all. Like you go, if, I got, if, I, if you push me to the point where I got to actually hit a girl, I'm going to show you why you... What the fuck and I'm gonna be loud about. I'm be like, all right, bitch. Why? Why? Yeah, I'm, I'm, a, a, I'm a confirm everybody to Everybody gotta know. Like, I want that bitch in the last thing I said to you. I'm gonna do this bitch bad. You got shot. You got shot. And I yeah, need, I need, I, I need people around me to witness that she doing this. You feel me? Oh, I miss Hennessy. Ooh. Uh-oh. That shit hit the chest, huh? Yeah, that shit good. <laughs> Y'all be honest with y'all. I like tequila, right? But I be getting tequila because everybody else wants tequila. But I, I ain't like when bro walked in with Hennessy, I was like, we don't Ooh, drink tequila, bro. They got the bro. Hennessy. We don't even, honestly, we don't we drink. Drink we drink Doucet. We drink Doucet. We don't drink Hennessy. Okay, this be Hennessy. We it's only drink like, Doucet. Y'all got other episodes. I can't even mix it. But that shit will, you know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Another one? Hold on, cuz. I just had one. No, I think you want one, right? Oh, I thought that was you. I just had one. Oh, he just, no, he just had I one. No, this, this, this is just, you know, it's going to be sitting here waiting on you. I'm going to put my waiting on me. Y'all, so we mixing on this podcast. It's a subway across the street. All right, so speaking of being bullied and things like that, right? So another thing I've been dealing with lately is motherfucking trolls, right? So I've been getting motherfucking troll, y'all. I had, I had experienced somebody making a whole TikTok about like something I said on my podcast, trying to cancel me, and I just feel like this, right? Shit, what you I feel like I can repeat it because baby, I didn't know the fucking was the problem, right? So at the time, y'all, on my podcast, I had said the word tranny. I didn't know it was a bad word. I feel like everybody around me in my motherfucking life has always said tranny. Like that's the thing I've seen on TV. People say tranny. Huh? There's another word. Well, yeah, what is it? I guess training? I didn't confirm it. They should have. They should have knowledge informed me instead of fucking getting on my ass. But I guess it just called him a. You said what is a training? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you a, know a what a training is. Oh, oh, I thought he said. Oh, a I thought tranny? he said a tranny. A tranny. What would be a tranny though? What do you think that would be? Just guess. What would be a tranny? Somebody you training to be gay? <laughs> Bitch, no. Why well, was somebody somebody you training to be? Gay. Okay, so <laughs> if you tra- how would you train somebody to be gay? <laughs> What the fuck? What kind of hey, weird shit is that? Hey, anyway, man, the word is motherfucking training that I be saying, right? So basically, I feel like this person got offended saying that shit, and then I actually had somebody that uh, was close to it, or whatever, like more feminine. They even said the word too. So basically, I be dealing with trolls, right? I had a troll basically had to say, like, one problem they be getting on my ass about is uh, they feel like I be being rude to y'all on my show. I feel like I be being rude to y'all. But that's just, they, that's you gotta your, know how to take it. That's your personality. Yeah. No one's like, been offended. I always miss y'all asking how y'all doing at the end of the podcast and shit like that. I get feedback, baby. So anyway, go. I feel like this. Do y'all deal with trolls? And if y'all don't deal with trolls, y'all deal with like fake pages, catfishes, all that shit, just like other shit. I mean, yeah. we don't really get troll type shit because we not fucking famous. The catfish is but for the catfish sure. You don't have to, shit, no, you can get troll on some lame shit. Y'all remember fucking the back in the day? I don't know how Mississippi was, but you say you from A Leaf or whatever. Yeah. All right, so <laughs> so basically, like, do you feel like uh, y'all ain't had like the little old? What house we went to? I went to uh, Fort Ben Travis. But okay, my, so my it, mama lived. We live in front of Hastings, and my mama worked at Hastings. And if you know you from Houston, if you live, if your if your people work in the school district, you do not have to go to school in they that district. So don't play y'all. me. Cause they always over explain. I'm just looking. I'm looking at this nigga because I already know what you're gonna try to do me on when we. They when this always give a resume. They always want to show you their Google Maps. Okay. <laughs> They, yeah, that's what I'm saying. So, yeah, okay. Drop in the comment below if you ever seen him. Okay, anyways. Now, nah, yeah. I know he's from Andy. Relax. Relax. <laughs> All right, so like I was trying to say, you may forgot what I was trying to fucking say. What, where was I going you with said this? said something about, uh... Oh, what high school you went to? Say something high school you went to. Okay, cool. So, do you not... Did y'all not have to deal with them fake... Like, like the little bully pages on Facebook? Okay, oh. that shit was funny, though. Yeah, no, but I mean, I was, nah, I, I was never on them. I was never on them. That, that was the worst form of bullying. That was never yeah. on them hoes, but that shit was funny. That'll make somebody to kill themselves, though. Yeah, like that ass. Why yeah. you that? That's <laughs> not funny, that. I would that don't really make somebody that. kill I wouldn't expect them to say that shit. That shit, no, I ain't gonna lie. Being bullied in your face is different from like the Facebook bullying. Like waking up to that shit, first thing in the morning, all you see is like, okay, I'm gonna tell my story. They didn't even talk about me being gay. That bitch that had a bill pipping nose, bitch, that fucked me <laughs> up. Like, damn, bitch, like, 
You could have came for everything else, but I ain't like to that day. I be like, damn, bitch. I have to embrace my little, my little black nose. You know what I'm saying? It ain't Bill Pepper, bitch. But I feel like this. Like, what's no, some, like strong. you? Was you ever on the pages? Nah, I never been on the page. Well, what y'all? You ain't never been on the page. Mm-hmm. So you ain't never really. Be, so you really never like, hey, except the car thing. You never really been bullied. So was you a bully? Hmm. Hmm. I wasn't a bully. He, he wasn't. I don't nobody. think he was a bully. Hell no. Nah. No, not. listen. Me growing up, my daddy was a professional boxer, so he's a beat your ass. Yeah. Nah, I get it. Me and my, my daddy, daddy used, to used to go tell my ass it, bro. Up. But she liked it. My daddy is like one of the top dudes from where I'm from, so like a lot of respect come behind my last name. So I feel like y'all. Hold on one second. We back. We back. Anyways, my bad, y'all. I thought I was hearing shit. Thought I was hearing ghosts. That's on me. Okay, don't beat me up. All right. Anyways, I got a motherfucker saying. So you said your daddy used to, you know, handle you, treat you how to be a stand up guy, shit like that. Mm-hmm. So have you ever took up for a bully? Um, no. I feel like you probably had problems that used to bully people. You used to sit there. <laughs> Don't lie. It's okay. I mean, yeah. She used to get bullied. I know damn what you used to do. You used to sit there, for sure. Hey, okay, look. When I stopped getting bullied and I became, I wouldn't say I became the bully. You was Captain Saber bully? You mean Captain Saber nerd? No, I wasn't Saber nerd, but nah. We was beating niggas ass, though. When I had realized I can fight, I was starting beating niggas ass. So, I'm going to ask y'all a real nigga question. Don't motherfucking lie. Mm-hmm. Was y'all homophobic in high school and middle school? Bully what? I've never been against Was y'all sh- why you look President Obama? Okay. Damn. <laughs> I, don't want I also told some off cameras, Karen, this motherfucker Aggie Perry, like, you made us know we bad people. I'm not homophobic, but. Wait. Chill. Don't say it like that. Come on, let me explain. I'm not homophobic, but I was raised a certain way by my pops. Like, he's a homophobe. So, we, we be having this conversation all the time. We do. He said. Don't you say that no, shit. No, he don't. said if he has a gay child. He's not, the child is not going to stay with him. He going to send him to Uncle Kyron. And I'm like, why are you not going to keep your child? You I didn't say like, I wasn't going to love you. I said, even even if I said that his child would have been rich, <laughs> he said he don't care. He's still going to I didn't him say I was not going to be there, take care of him, love him, support him, and be there you for him. You kicked him out. But he's just not going to stay in my house. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, bitch, what? You're not gonna fucking take care of your motherfucking child because they're gay? Stop saying that. I did yeah, not say no, that. No, but you shit. said you kicked him out. I didn't say I was gonna just kick him out and say, go live out on the So corner. why we go to Uncle Kyle's house? But I house? did say I'm gonna, you know what I'm saying? Why we go to Kyle's house at all? I wouldn't say, I didn't say just Kyle. <laughs> There's other options. You said Uncle Kai. <laughs> but Uncle Kyle for shit show. Sure. Why? Okay, wait, no. Fuck the Kyle part. Why would you not? Why would you kick your child out? I mean, shit. Um, that's, I don't know. That's how I was. Okay, so daddy told, told him that's that. How my daddy, that's how my daddy told me. Like, he was like, bro, if you was gay, he wouldn't have had a son. Okay, so why you want to be like your ignorant ass daddy? I mean, shit, that's just how I was brought no. up, bro. So I don't okay, see you a lot. You know about but generational curses? Huh? Generational curses? You're right. I, so I, I have gay friends. Fuck I'm cool friends. with gay fuck people. Fuck us, fuck all your friends. I'm you talking about your people. son. My son can't. I'm sorry. Personally. Personally. You can't control it, though. I'm going to show you. You gonna show him what? You finna boost your child? Huh? You finna boost your child? Like a motherfucker. Oh my god, no, God. Me, you boy, TJ, see if I can figure your name, but I'm already canceling you in my head. But uh, all right, I'm not gonna say that you know, like he always say, something might change when I feel like this. When I feel like he's saying that shit, it's gonna be the main one that little forgot your child. Exactly. You're gonna be the main one. I ain't gonna lie. I really I ain't gonna lie, I know you bitch. You not this type of nigga gonna do nothing ignorant shit like that. Like, I feel like you saying that shit for her, her right now, but I feel like nah, you mean, I don't see When it come like down that. in that situation, I don't see you doing that shit. I, like, I hope I hope it does. Because then think about this, little real nigga should think about this. I ain't tell my people till I was like 18, 19, 20. Boy, you gonna little forgot your child by the time you 19 and 20. You didn't tell them that you was gay? They knew, but I mean, you ain't tell oh, them. Oh, yeah. Oh, if yeah, I, I was if I know, say, like, if that I, was clueless if I, then. Like, if I know. Relax. I could have been very masculine. If bitch. I know, if I know for shit show, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to bring it up. Like, look, like, let's have a conversation. You can't bring it up. My mom tried to bring it up one time, and I cried. Don't I don't bring give it up. a fuck. Wipe them tears. We're going to have a conversation. That's so painful. Mama, I was in the bed, so y'all, my mom walked in. She was like, hey, by the way, are you gay? <laughs> 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 like, like bitch, I'm still in the bad too. What's so that thing was like shit? Am. Like a motherfucker. Like I'm in there trying to get the soap out of my fucking eyes. I'm and you ain't bitch, shit. mama. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, what's up? Like, fuck, like, nah, why, girl. Why she picked that time to come in the oh, bathroom? Oh my mama, because mama he was by himself. No, my brother was in the living room and shit. Like he, to, it was like a Sunday. You know when your mama got his Sunday, all the blinds up, so it was bright as fuck in the house. Yeah. It was like one of those days. Oh she, oh the mm. God was that was God then. But I ain't telling her that shit. That was God saying. So you know, it pissed me out one time by my people, question. me having to come out to my people. One time they had like, y'all remember Kick? Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I didn't have like a phone phone. Well, I had a phone. I don't know why I would get my mama an iPad and I would like get her iPad, download Kick, log into Kick, and I would talk to all different type of people on there, right? But like in general, I like I can't tell y'all that shit, but it's it's I, y'all find out one day whenever I post the episode, but it's a little secret to it. But in general, I was talking to different type of people. 
And like my mama had like got the, I had woke up on my sleep. I fell asleep with the like, log, kick still locked in. Woke up on my sleep and the iPad was in her room no more. Oh, hell no. I understand. It was a silence in that house on a Sunday. I never heard silence in my house on a Sunday. No noises in that house. <laughs> The silence was so damn loud. <laughs> I just knew, like, okay. Then when I got up, right, I had walked past her room. She had her doors open. She had, she got two doors. She walked past her room and like she didn't say shit to me. So I just kept going downstairs, walked past my day. Nobody said shit to me. I was like, okay, cool, cute. Everybody just kind of like act like they don't see the shit. We got dressed and shit. They was like, get dressed. We finna go to the town center. They had some to the town center, like a little waterfall. Sat me at the town center. And he was like, do you like boys? <laughs> and I was like, no. <laughs> hey, cool. Knowing like I know you seen the mission, but I'm nose and then you know they talking about some you know we don't care if you like dogs, cats, whatever the fuck, yeah, yeah. I'm like, no, nah, I ain't gay, no, I ain't gay, no, I ain't gay. And every Memorial Day I remember that shit. It happens on Memorial Day. No, what's holiday in September? I think it's Memorial Day actually. Every Memorial Day is when it happened, y'all. It was Memorial Day that happened. Oh. So yeah, I feel like my people been knowing from that. Like you can't say you ain't know. If you seen your child yeah, in the act. Uh, that's what I'm saying. Like if you know, it's on you at that moment. So did they, how did they treat you after that? Normal. They kept going, wash some dishes, and make sure you do your homework. That's Labor Day. Mm. Labor Day? It was either Memorial Day or Labor Day, y'all. Okay, so basically, if you saw, if y'all caught your child, right, sucking dick, son, what you doing? Oh! Oh! Now, nah, that's I'm a gonna beat the fuck that, out of both yeah, of them. Yeah, that's a different story. In my house? I'm, I'm not gonna lie, like, I'm not against him, them being gay, but you ain't finna do no gay activities that's why in I my house. Yeah, that's that, no gay activities. Period. Can your straight son fuck in your house? No. Pussy? Yeah. He got to ask me, though. Yeah. It got to be something we, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, hey. So how you want your son to come to you and ask you? You straight. Hey, hey Pops, like, can I can I bring little mama over type Hey, Pops, shit? can I fuck some pussy in this house? Can I bring little mama over for the night? Or can I, no, no, not for the night. I ain't going to be like that type Why of Why for the night? Man. I mean, they already fuck be, once. What's the night going to do? I'm not going to say for the night because, like, shit, that's pushing it. Like, you already know how that shit go. I'm not going to be no dumb. I don't even got to You think the night going to guarantee she get pregnant? If she spend the night, it's going to guarantee pregnancy? No, I'm just saying, bro. Like, I need to say. Are you going to teach our kids how to fuck? Hell yeah. How? Shit. I'm how? A, personally, I'm going to just show Not, no. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> hey. Whoa. How? Not like that. <laughs> not like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, shit. Porn. We gonna use we gonna use pillows and shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna show cut like this is what you do, and then I'm gonna show porn. I remember the first time I got experienced the porn, bro. That shit, that shit scared the shit out of me. I was like older people. It was what? like HBO porn. You was watching old people fuck? No, I wasn't watching old people fuck. I was around older people, not okay. old, not grandmas. No, bitch. Oh. I was watching HBO porn, like the little, you know, oh. what I'm talking about. Oh, when on you the got TV. Cartoon Network on, oh, and you yeah, got yeah, HBO yeah, porn. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, you know, yeah. we at your granny house, you got no ass, so you know, somebody finna walk in. And then the whole time, I'm like, I wonder, like, I ain't gonna lie, they probably would made me think I was, well, I ain't for sure gay, but it's probably what made me start questioning, right? Because I was like, oh, I'm not getting hard to this, but it was white people. That's why I was getting hard to it. No matter who it was, bitch, I ain't like this shit. That HBO porn was bullshit. I used to yeah, watch it. Like, I used bullshit. to watch it though, like it was a movie. But it was so stupid. Very just slow. It was very slow. Like honest to God, when I look at it, like did they ever really? fuck? I was like, can I just fuck? But that's called soft porn. That's why they never really fucked. I, I know never, it's we soft never saw porn. Shit. I don't like soft. Porn. Now we watch that that hardcore. They fucking yeah, the shit I out of each other. Cell phone porn. Hit porn. Dome. I love I, cell phone porn. That's I wanna, my shit. I want to say. Like, oh like, nah, cell phone like porn. Like porn type shit. No, like natural. Like. Open your phone right now, iPhone phone. That's the video. Okay, cool. I want to see it. Like I want to see it from y'all cell phone. Like I don't okay. want all that bougie ass shit. I honestly ain't been recorded. I ain't fucking recorded sex in so long. You ever snuck and recorded somebody? Yep. Ooh. Fucking right. Okay. I, I snuck and really I snuck and recorded you. Suck my dick. Sneak. Mm -hmm. okay, I, I, so I okay, we're gonna somebody. A girl just asked me, "What do y'all do with the videos? Keep them. Yeah, I keep them. You ever show? Y'all ever show each other a video? Uh uh. Show anybody a video? Mm mm. Yeah, I have. Okay, what though? A girl. Why? I've showed a girl. Why? Oh, she be into that. Yeah. Okay, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. When I used to like send this shit, I used to be like, I used to tell people like, oh, send me a video, you're like fucking. Come on, see like what's gonna hit. Yeah, though. fucking I right. See, like, I wanna see what's gonna hit. Yeah, I send girls shit, shit like, like that, bro. or that they ask like, you got some videos of like, yeah, but you gotta send me something first, so I know you're not finna. You ever pay for pussy? No. You ever pay for nudes? No. 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 You mm. ever pay for OnlyFans? No, yeah, yeah, I got right. porn for free. Yeah, why would I pay for OnlyFans? I got that I can go. I got hello insights for free. Yeah. So how often do y'all masturbate? Um, as much as possible. Really? Pretty yeah, much. That's normal. I'd be mad if I miss it. Okay, so I have a question. Okay, so I feel like this. <laughs> I feel like niggas. No, real nigga shit. I feel like okay. I feel like now as we get older, I feel like everybody be like yeah a lot. I masturbate a lot, right? But same, I feel like everybody be fucking. So I feel like. I don't think y'all don't be fucking. So I feel like, why do y'all assume that's baby? Y'all be fucking. I feel like uh, that should be like a I, I I I laid back from fucking like all the 
time. You feel me? It get draining. Soul ties and all that shit. Yeah, no. it, it, nah, not really soul ties. It's just it's draining. Energy, it's like, energy to put into that shit. You gotta set it up. You gotta yeah, 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 calm just doing too so much. You, this motherfucker right here. Get the job this on. And then sometimes you, and you ain't gotta to cuddle. get in your car and go somewhere. I ain't gotta like... cuddle. I ain't gotta lot of you and say, hey, my nigga confident gonna take me, give me some food. Yeah. It's legit just a swipe delete app gone. Yeah, exactly. Facts. I'm a gone handle like... the business. Hey, but I'm some real shit. Like what? But after wait, wait, wait. After that though, after the masturbation, I'd be, be like so bad. Like, I'd be like, you dirty motherfucker. <laughs> I don't feel that anymore. I be feeling like I be feel okay. Maybe because like like I said, I used to be like be down bad. So I feel like for me, I be lucky, proud of myself. Like good, you ain't got fucked. I'm some real nigga shit. That may sound weird to say that shit. Like I feel like I, my shit's a different approach. But like me know how I used to operate. Like I be proud of myself. Like okay, good. I like just shit. you ain't gonna do no dumb shit. Yeah, I, I feel, feel like it's shit, that y'all. to that point. Yeah, y'all, like where... I just beat my me up. Like y'all finna go to sleep for real now. Yeah, yeah, it's it's really a bedtime thing. Like <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, fuck a bedtime, bedtime story, thing bitch. I need for a bedtime sure. nut hoe. But I, That's what I'm talking about. And then go hop in the shower and go to sleep. Like. I'm gonna just wipe myself off. I ain't okay. I'm not having a shower. I ain't getting back up. They may sound disgusting to say, y'all. I'm not getting back up. You too. Ugh. I ain't saying, bro. I ain't getting back up, cuz. Bitch, you fold your socks, don't you? No. I just fold your socks. Fuck no. Then they can say hop in the shower. No. Okay, so like, have y'all ever like accidentally nutted in your face? What? Have you ever accidentally nutted in your face? No, no, no. Wait. No, I got a story. We have a story of a nigga. Just listen. All right, this dude. Y'all both have a story about somebody nutting their face. Wait, listen. Bro, just listen. He came out the blue and told me. He told us. So look. Go ahead. He told me that he was beating his meat or whatever, he was masturbating, and he said he was laying down or whatever. So he said he put the towel on his chest. That mean he so, ran, that mean he, he was aiming for it. Yeah, so look, I said, bro, like, why you nutting on yourself, you feel me? Because that's yeah, weird that to me, you that feel too. me? Like, that's weird. You do the same, you told me you do the same thing, that's you put weird. put the towel all over you? Yeah, I put the towel right here. Because why would you want to nut on yourself? I put the right. towel from my right here and then just pull it up. So as soon as I nut, First I First of all, why just... do you have a big-ass drying towel? <laughs> why not? Why so? I mean, shit, it's a shower towel. No. I just put wait, the Wait, wait, real quick. I'm going to let you get a story real quick. Y'all I... got like a dirty towel? Or wait, a clean what towel? you mean? You got a dirty towel or a clean towel when you about to do it? Oh, I use a clean towel. I just talk about shower with last. Oh yeah, yeah, the yeah. shower towel. Yeah, yeah the shower sure. towel. That's a dirty towel. Oh my god. Yeah. Follow the story. Go ahead. Right, the story. So he's like, he put the towel on his chest. So he was masturbating, and he didn't like the video that it was that he was watching already. But he, stop. but he couldn't stop, so he came, and somehow it got on his chest, and then his phone hit his chest, and he bought his phone up because he was like. I'm gonna go into another video and I'm gonna go for a round two. That's so hard. Which I never heard That's so of somebody hard, going cause... into a round two after they masturbate. That's like shit. right after. That shit okay, is I, I, lie. Said, I be lucky. Like, okay, I, I be so, when I mess up, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna do two today. Damn. I never can. That I shit's can. hard, bro. Yeah, like, bitch, I be doing it. And then be, he was like, when he put shot. the phone up, the, the cum fell in his eye. I'm like, I'm also. But I do got another nigga who, on a team, he a motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? He be masturbating and he said he'd come in his face and he took a picture of that shit. No, he did. Oh, yeah, Jesus. Yeah. He a weird nigga. Like, he be getting his... He, uh, but I'm not going to lie, bro. Like, he, the, the inside he. the football locker yes. rooms be like... Yeah, color. Crazy. Oh, he. he is... Have you ever... Uh, okay, so... What you call that? So, y'all uh, both play sports, bro right? Chris. Right? Yeah, bro shit. Chris. <laughs> For real? Nah. Oh, so yeah, that's my question. So, I mean, y'all both play... I mean, he, I like he, he did say that he got uh, he, paid... Yeah. Nah, not paid, but he said his girl put a uh thumb. Uh, no, not a thumb. The, the butt plug. The butt plug in him. So would you say? Would you? He gave yeah, him. he gay, huh? Yeah, I, I don't know. We're not gonna push that agenda, but I'm saying like he <laughs> I into mean, that. he taking penetration. Like nah, that's not like gay. It. Are you ever gonna get yourself checked when you get older? Like the little test. That yeah, we but get? you got to. But so that's penetration. You got paid. But that's because but I have to. His girl did it. Like okay, maybe he had to. No, he no he loved that. His girl was like, I'll leave. You know. No, he loved that shit. Like. He be saying, okay, so y'all against penetration. Would you ever try with your wife in the future? No. What you mean penetration? No. Like, just no fuck nothing me. penetrating Butt me. No. 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 Finger. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Okay. I'm not doing that either. Shit. I'll get my ass. Right. Hey, you ain't got to. Okay. That's okay. A lot of niggas saying that shit. Hey, Kyle, uh, just you from Mississippi. You ain't got to ask. But that me. don't mean that should be born out of y'all. That should be a trick. I'ma help you lift the other <laughs> leg up. Shit. He said that should All be I a trick. I feel like this, right? I feel like this, real nigga shit. I feel like when y'all get older and shit like that, Kyron. 
you gonna have to start doing more shit with your wife or the shit gonna get boring and stuck. I ain't gonna lie to you like yeah. some real nigga shit. Like you not for the rest of your life. Think about how you fuck now, right? It's just straight to the motherfucking point and don't be like, nah, I be doing it. Ain't nobody gonna fuck with that lame shit you claim you do. Real nigga shit, right? I ain't gonna lie. A bitch gonna want a wild die and not talk to a hella bitch on the show. Bitches want to like adventure their nigga, except it's like unless it's like a ghetto ass bitch. Bitches want to like adventure their nigga and niggas wanna adventure their bitch and shit. I'm not gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie, I had the hardest nigga come in this time and be like, yeah, I want my bitch to do that shit. Like, yep. let's I'm not gonna. I'm, act, I'm I mean, not gonna we can act, we can do the I extra mean, shit to her, but we not penetrating <laughs> me at all. So like, you okay? Just just for the rest of your life, just pussy done. Yeah, and you know we can experience the other things that she want to experience with her. But as far okay, as so what's something that you want to experience? It ain't gotta be none of the bullshit. Look, but like, what do you want to experience? But it has to be something that's gonna please you. Look, uh, for no females, he won't even look. <laughs> I even told this nigga about getting his Gucci. <laughs> Cause was like that's not even a choice. That's, that's kind of like natural. No, no, that's, that's natural. That's a choice. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah that's you gotta natural. get that shit that's done. That's natural. But he talking about she going lower and look, all this shit like I'm, that. I'm so I'm you. like, listen. I'm gonna lift the other leg. Look, yeah, see, you, look. Mama. Come he, on, get up under that shit. You feel me? He in there like in like, missionary mama. style. You I did not say that himself. Wait, missionary Wait, what is yes, missionary? Huh? Yes, I did. Like, yeah. But you rather be missionary or me turn my ass around and get on fours. I, you pick, it's on you. <laughs> <laughs> no, I already ain't gonna lie. Shining definitely gotta be a missionary. This bitch, you gotta at least be a missionary. I feel like you already missionary. I feel like a bitch should lick your shit. Even a bitch wanna suck your, like, lick on your nuts, she gonna probably do that shit real quick. Yeah. So, yeah, bitch, I mean, your sex just gotta be boring at this point. Oh, well, my sex? Yeah, it gotta be straight. It's, it's giving, it's giving your yeah, Mississippi vibes. Especially if I'm like In under the influence. Oh, it's over with. Like, I'm trying to do whatever. I'm... I ain't gonna lie, you know what's crazy though? A bitch gonna watch the scene and probably wanna fuck with you. Cause my husband and I know they really like want to do that shit. Like I ain't gonna lie, like damn you, I could have done y'all episode. It's a bitch who left a voicemail on my previous episode, and she was like, I ain't gonna lie to you, why niggas don't just be honest, say they want to experience different shit. Cause I really want a nigga that's gonna let me experience different shit with him and really like take it there and shit like right. that. And I ain't gonna lie, the bitch even had got on my lie one time talking about shit, and she was not ugly. She was fine in a bitch. That's right. Hard like, in a bitch. What do she want to experience? Like, look, bro, like, look. She just wanna like. Just nothing. It's not even a wild shit. Look, she don't want to fuck her nigga, I, nothing like that. Well, that's what I'm saying. Like, I'm I like to, that. I'm you know, going like. to lick you from literally your neck. Yeah, her. From, from yeah. your head to your ankles. I don't like feet. That's like a pet peeve in me. So from your head to your feet. Shit, if you try to you taste me. ears and shit. Hairs? What you ears. mean? Fucking right. I put my tongue in Bro, your ear. I ain't going to lie. That shit feel good. I put my tongue in the ear. That shit like, feel good. I know what I'm like. So have y'all, ever, that shit? Yeah. have y'all ever run a train on somebody? No. Yeah. I haven't. Hell yeah, that shit fun. You give me like very like overly sexual. I'm not overly sexual, but I like I like to like if I'm feeling that shit, come on my mama. I'm no, gonna I'm do saying it. like you give me like you've done a lot of sexual things. Like yeah, like I had a partner like he used to like everything sexual under the sun. Like he was like yeah, I did that yeah, cool yeah, like, pretty much like I want to I want to do wanna it. Let's rock for both y'all. From scale one to ten, what be our sex drive? Like ten being the highest. Five. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't like to have sex all the time. I I will just get my dicks up and. Same. I, I don't know too many motherfuckers that get their dick they get their dick sucked more than me on some real shit. Nah. I don't like the fuck all the nah, time. That's why you gyrating and shit. That's like you you just craving some pussy. I gotta nah, feel that shit. Nah, I ain't craving no pussy. But if I'm if I'm not in the mood, I'm not in the mood. I don't want to fuck. Okay, so are y'all like a clean fuck? Like do y'all like to like like are y'all like a do y'all talk when y'all have sex? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. What y'all be saying? Uh, Kyra. We done went through it. It really just depend on the female and what the occasion is. Facts. Like, the, all right, Miss look, all right, listen. Miss nah, listen. No, I'm finna Not give him Miss a scenario He's about a bird, the other day. Y'all. All right, so look, if the girl got a nigga, yep. then I'm gonna talk to her crazy. Crazy. Like the other the other day, I was hitting some nigga girl in his crib, and <laughs> I'm not like him, guys. <laughs> look, I was just telling her like I was like, you a slut, like. The whole time, like, you a slut, like you a dirty bitch. And she like, <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie though. They like okay. that shit. They love that shit. Like what you. else? And she like, she like, I'm a slut for real. I'm yeah. like, yeah. So when I tell them that, I just treat them anyway. You I feel be me? Like, like I'm coming on your face, like you swallowing, like you, you know what that tells everything. though. And I say this all the time. I see my opinion. I feel like females, where where a female lets you nut tells a lot about her character. Oh yeah, no, for sure. I feel like a female like Personally, if you ask a bitch, you, we talk about this. Yes, like, but if 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 you swallow, I'm talking about like a random, like first time you fucked her. Yes. Yeah, 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 that's yeah. true. That's Not true. Your girlfriend in bitch, you I'm a gonna hoe. look at you like you, you a nasty, hoe. Like, like, if, like I'm saying, like you ask a bitch, like, what you want me to do? And she like, my face, girl. Well, that's your first. I'm time. Not, I'm that's wait, your first choice. First of, first of all, I don't even ask. Sometimes it's just it's that got to be natural. You feel me? Like, I mean, when you talk to me, you in your shit. You supposed to be like, what you want me to do? What you want to like? You supposed to like. I know, but sometimes, sometimes, but so she be like, bring your face here. What you be? 
Yeah, I'll grab me by your neck. Come here. I'm finna. Yeah. Hey. Why you make an But like, this, over this here. what I do, right. like, type shit. <laughs> cameras over here. Like, this type <laughs> shit, like, like, let's say I'm fucking you from the back, and then, like, I feel like fuck, I, I feel like nothing on somebody back is just weird. No, no, no. I don't be nothing. Yeah. Like, I'll like, put your face on the ground. Like, I'll put your face like in the in the fucking bed, and I'll like pull it out all the way, and then be like, Wait, what did she say? <laughs> I'll put her face in the bed, but her ass up. You know what I'm saying? But I will smother your face in the bed. You trying to kill this house? And I'll pull it all out, and then be like, shit. Where you want me to nut? But I'll do it in her ear type shit, and then I like beg for me to nut. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Babe, tell me you want that shit. Me like, <laughs> tell me like, you want that shit. Like, <laughs> it ain't no choice with me. I be, I be, I be having sex too long. Oh my mama, that's my. Y'all be doing gas station pills? No, no. I have, have though. No. I have though. Hey, what does it do? What does it do? I look on some real shit. Like, it work. I'm scared. But here's the problem. Here's the problem. You're not gonna know it works. What? You're not gonna know it work until you really around a bitch. All she gotta do is touch you. And it's going to fucking trigger. What if you don't like the person? It's going to make you like the person? Nah. It, if you into the sex, if you know you finna have sex and you know you want to have sex, as soon as she touch you, that shit going <laughs> to... Boy. Oh, my God. But I'm the so problem excited. is, yeah, it bring, one so thing, it, have, it, bring, <laughs> See, it bring a headache and it lasts for a few days. So, like, you know how you walking and you got some drawers on that's not super tight and your dick start moving around and you feel that shit, your dick going to get hard. <laughs> Wait, what do y'all do? Okay, so I do this a lot. Well, I don't do this a lot, but like I be catching like random boners throughout the day. Like, oh yeah, not no I'm more because of football for me. Well, you on like steroids? No, nigga, what the fuck? The <laughs> I be busy. The fuck? I be having shit going on, nigga. I don't care. I, I be, be running. Busy. I could be a fucking church. And next thing I know, they say amen. They oh, oh my man. god, like nah, oh nah, that's, god. that's horrible. The, hey, the past good, but the past can get us to be all rise, all in the risen. Trust me, like <laughs> fuck, like I be catching random boners for real. Hell nah. Uh, I mean, shit, it comes. Like, I'd be in a grocery store and motherfucker be shopping for bread and it'd be the whole, whole lied, wheat, a whole honey butter. I have honey had a, bon- oh, I had a bread? boner in the middle of football practice and I was like, what the fuck? Nah, yeah, it'd be like, what the fuck? And it don't be that your mind be on that shit. No, it just happened. My mind don't be on that shit. It I just, just fold be, that bitch up between my pants. Fold that bitch up yeah, between I, my waistline. I think the classroom thing is the worst. Yes, that's the worst one. Yeah, I just be like, lifting my shit. Yeah, I just lift that motherfucker, put it between the belt line, keep pushing. Yeah, <laughs> I probably see a girl in like, class and get to thinking about some shit like. No, we're not. Damn, nigga, that's lust. That's yeah. That's like that's, I mean, I that's okay. porn ball shit. Hey, that's girl, like. You trying to fuck? But but, but, just said I'm but I will it say all. though, if I think about it, I will do it. Like if I tell you, like you feel me? If I tell you, like TJ, like. I seen a female in class. Oh, type shit, type shit. Yeah. I want to fuck her. I'm going to go do yeah, it. Yeah, reject off the pictures? Uh, pictures of yes. my girl. When I was a kid. But not like naked when pictures. When I was younger. Like, like oh, I want to fuck her something. Yeah, when like, I was younger. You go do mulatto shit and just, whoo. When I was a little younger, yeah. Yeah, it's Kyra. Like, <laughs> bro, I didn't watch what, what that was, Bad Girls Club <laughs> when I was little. It was like, oh, yeah. I have seen some bro, movies and be like. females, bad. Like, oh, I got to go nut um, right which now. Season? I want to say give me one this, bitch name the, I could Natalie. Oh God, no! That season. Natalie, funny. I mean, I was young. Natalie is a pretty girl, actually. I was young. She's so a pretty I girl. I, I haven't very seen her now. You feel me? Very but beautiful woman. Natalie gonna see this hoe and then what the pretty girl? Hey, <laughs> very pretty girl. Well, Natalie, you know. But I don't know. It seems, I think Natalie was on the season with like. I didn't watch that season. That was we was too we was too young. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Was young I'm older than you. I didn't watch that. That was I'm 22. Old. Okay, bitch. Why you have to do that? How old are you? It don't fucking matter, but I already claimed I'm ugly. Why, why bitch, did I so. have to do that? <laughs> no, why did you have to say your age if I was trying to make you seem like you was old or some bitch? Oh, no, I thought you, you said how old are you? I said I'm older than you. you I'm oh. 22. Okay, so now they already know. Don't say nothing younger than 22. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> bitch. Anyways. All right, so Bad Girls Club. You said Natalie. Anybody else? Can we do a different season? Like, are more relevant? Uh, what's the twins' name? Claremont Twins, that season. Uh, them and that's the it. They other. had Jayla on there that season. Like, you watch a lot the, of Bad the, Girls Club, but I got a lot of sisters. Like five. Go like, outside. Huh? Nigga, play like four of them. Play five. some sports. Nah. He, no, he got a shit ton of. Wait, I thought it was only six people. No, he got trial. a shit ton of. But I family. didn't count my daddy killed children. Oh, of course, you watching Bad Girls Club. You didn't watch Keeping Up with Kardashians too. Yeah, done too. That's cool. That's why you're not uh sexually liberated. You he got a shit ton of. Hey, nah, nah, nah. I'm very sexual. What you call it? Liberated. Liberated. Because, hey, I be telling them, back to that bonus shit, you feel me? What I tell you, 
Bro, I be I be ready before the girl even bro, get that. Bro, on Jesus Christ. Hey, all she got to do is come hold in on. and say, Let me tell you, girl, hey, on my mama, ready, like, this was like last year oh, before the semester ended. So Cairo finna fuck the girl. And he had to say, I'm finna come back, I'm get my clothes, and I'm finna fuck this bitch real quick. You give me and, you nuff ass because of that, though. If he want to. Yeah, if I want to. <laughs> if he want to. I already so, explained come. to you. It's look, 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 listen, but listen. Come. So look, Cub went to that motherfucker and he was like, what's up, TJ? The girl walk in the room. When I say on God, less than two minutes, all I hear is, I said, did this nigga say hello? Like, did this nigga speak to this bitch? Damn, did he off that bitch on water? Bro, I that know. shit, I was like, and then she was out the door in like 10 minutes. And he was like, shit, I did, I got what I needed to do. I was like, yeah, this nigga I'm a, Kyle, Hey, I'm going to go crazy. Personally, I don't really do the round shit. I'm just, wait. You got one real long Hey, bitch. hey, t- wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait. Let me let I'm me confuse what's going on. Yeah, like listen to this. Hey, after oh, my no graduation, me. I went crazy. Like oh. it's somebody, <laughs> hey, it's somebody in this room that can vouch that I went crazy. Eight rounds straight. Eight rounds straight. Uh, not me. I ain't the voucher. Facts. You was on the pill, don't lie. Nope. Oh God, I wasn't. He was just on that. No, <laughs> bro. I'm oh telling God. you, like I just got. <laughs> hey, he just caught the he caught the wind. So, like, TJ, I heard about you. I heard that your dick is little. You heard that? Mm-hmm. Well, I guess that's what you heard, then, gang. Yeah. So, for the hoes that said that shit, do you want to talk to them for a second? I mean, shit. If that's what you think. Bitches love that shit, though. If that's what you say. Okay, I'll ask a question. So, real nigga shit. We're gonna go down the panel. Do you think your dick would be? I'm playing. I was joking. All right. Do you think your dick would be small, medium, or large? I'm for sure between. And let's not lie. I'm for sure so above a seven on some gang on some real. No, I'm about a seven. Okay, on some, seven. Stop on some real so, shit. So Subway sandwich is a six. So I was like, okay, cool. I got a good size dick. For right, sure. I got a question for you. We're gonna follow up with the question. What do you think? Small, medium, or large? Uh, about around the same what seven. About three. All right, cool. Love that. Hey, All girl. right, so anyway, so do y'all think, right? Do you think it's really about like for girls? You think it's really about size? You think it's more like a? It depends. You can't like be no. You, doing, you can't man. be st- stupid small. Like I, I don't know. Like nah, I, it be niggas that stupid small. For real? Yes. Bitch, Wait, fuck the gay shit about bro, it. I'm talking about. Have you not watched Euphoria? Oh, I mean, yeah. we done, we done been in the locker room. Oh, and no we, weird shit, but like we, no, we all seen it. On no gay shit, like we, we had football. to watch we, it. We, like, play we, football. we play football, we play football, so yeah. we see. Like, not like we don't. You know what I'm saying? And, but, and it be majority of the white people. It be white bro, people. Like most of the niggas be straight. On some, I'm not gonna say like on no weird gay shit, but you know what I'm saying? Like we're following, we're following, we're following, we're following. Okay, so with that being said, no, we're following for real. So with that being saying, right? Do you feel like girls would be like, oh, when they get mad at you, like, oh, yo, your dick was little. I honestly feel like this. Other than not some white people, because we know. I don't feel like black people. Nobody black like really just generally has like. I feel like everybody has That's at least. True. true. I'm tripping. That's I'm tripping true. like a motherfucker. I'm tripping like a motherfucker. Well, j- the, n- the normal They're thing. Normal, I feel like at least normal things, we, right? I feel like nobody has like dick. six and above. That's one normal thing. Like yeah. we were talking about, like doctor shit. Like I feel like every doctor be like, damn, everybody at least got six, seven. I feel like this. I feel like porn has normalized twelve inch dicks, eleven inch dicks. I feel like you yeah, get to steroid dildos dildos and shit those like bitches. those are not steroid dicks. People really build like this. I thought no. But, trust me, niggas just build like this. Yeah. I didn't bro. see some out of pocket shit. No, that be surgical, cup. bro. No, I didn't see surgical motherfucking shit. Like bro, people been like very like, bro. This nigga had surgery on his dick where his shit like three Hennessy bottles. Bro, look, 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 I ain't gonna say, look. I'm some real shit. No gay shit for me. But my freshman year at UIW, because I was sitting down in my locker. The fuck is that? What is UIW? It's a school. In Carnival Word. In Carnival Word. Hey, all my UIW people, he said that shit. Because they for sure going to say something about that shit. They don't like that. I'm sorry. But, so, I was sitting down in my locker room, because, and all I see is a motherfucker, and I see a dude walking past me. It was like my second day of practice. And he was like, shit, good shit to that young nigga. And I was like, appreciate it, gang. But when I look up, Cause his his dick his towel was hanging off his dick, but like, on God that bitch started at his knee. How old was he? He was a senior at the time. Like a senior, real, real senior, like a fifty year old senior. Nah, a real senior. African. No name is. Just black. <laughs> Why you say his name? Oh shit! 
Well, up for the house. Damn. You know what I gotta look for a house. Hey, but I already told. Hey, for the house. I, I already told her that shit. I was like, "Cuz, hey, for the house. Stay away from my bitch, cause on God, I'm gonna hit you." Okay, so have you ever felt like this, right? Would you allow your woo for a million dollars, right? If you was married, right? Yep. Would you let sure your will. anything? Sure will. Anything for a million? Yep. You too. Fuck right. You would let the nigga fuck your wife. Go ahead, gang. You would watch. Nah. Nah, no weird shit. Like, like the bouquet shit. Like, where you gotta watch your wife. If I had to, it don't have to be him. Anybody. If I had to, I sure will. For me, that's what you watch your wife get fucked. Fucking right. For me, that was what you watch your wife get trained. Poor niggas. Fucking right. Cause bitch, we gonna be up. We can go buy you a new. Okay, how about this? Let me add a little Andy. For a million dollars, would you watch your wife get trained by four men (sighs) with y'all firstborn child watching as well? Yeah. Million? I need like three. Wait, wait, wait. How? Oh, yeah. Firstborn child like. 13, they know what sex is. Five. Five mil, I'm God, we can do it. I'm yeah, I don't, I Two don't mil, one mil for the kid. Yeah, he gonna be rich. Three. Hey, I don't care. Therapy on you gotta meet my standards on this one. Three. Three on God, we can get it done. I ain't gonna have no questions. Me, I don't Okay, care. for one million dollars, would you let a group of foho jump your wife? Yes. <sighs> yeah. Bitch, you gonna have to fight back. Nah, they jump on her. <sighs> like, dragging her. Yeah, but trust hey, me. Once, man, we once, gonna pick once you up, it's over, I'm hey, 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 How about this? How about this? First lick, she damn the Sharkeisha, y'all. <laughs> Ooh. That's crazy. Hey, I know, that's how they start I know some girls who went to school with Sharkeisha, bro. So, okay, you letting the hoe, you watching your wife first lick, $1 million, first lick, they got Sharkeisha, that hoe. Mm. But they still coming in with the jumping. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Yeah. I'm, but as soon as that fight over, I'm gonna pick up and we going to the hospital because we got a million dollars. We can go get everything fixed. All right, for five million dollars, would you let your wife watch you get pegged by another woman? Yep. Five million dollars. Don't you sit here and lie, bitch. Kyrie. Don't you sit here and lie. On God, Kyrie, you'll do no. it for five million dollars. Ten million, Kyrie. On God, you'll do it for five. On God, you'll do it for three, nigga. The fuck? Ten. How you gonna tell me? Because, bitch, I'm asking you ten. Fuck five and ten three. Million. Ten. Ten million. Okay, all I say because we, we gotta take care of your mama, your sisters, all yeah, that shit. Ten million dollars just for your prize. Yeah, it's, it's so a, I feel yeah. like this, right? I feel like a lot of times people make these just dizzy, money decisions, right? I feel like niggas do dumb shit for less. They'll fucking rob a bank for it. They only have three hundred dollars in it, right? But when I get y'all these little scenarios, y'all be like, no, no, no. I feel like this, I'm right? Real. I feel like there's limits to how much y'all really are willing to do for like money, you, right? I mean, it's different when you see the money in your face. So it might, it okay, might ten million in your face, yo, and they be like, bro, yo. uh, all right, one million in your face, and they be like, bro, suck my dick. No. No, no, cuz. One million in your face. I ain't gonna lie, cuz. I'm curl. Nah, that's dead. That's dead. That ain't gonna lie, cuz. Okay, five million in your face. Oh, I'm eating that boy up. Five million in your face. I don't know gay shit. On my mama, I'm gonna get it done. I'm gonna get it done. I respect you. Real nigga shit. I'm gonna get that shit done. So, all right, before we wrap up, mention like that motherfucker, because you know how to put y'all in the motherfucker high seat. She's like, any questions for me before I jump back into y'all? I do got a statement. You be letting these hoes get on this podcast and lie. Yeah, they do. Oh, about what? You be having these hoes lie. I can't be specific right now because I can't repair, remember which video I was watching. But on God, you be letting these hoes lie. About niggas? Kyle, about a lot of shit. Especially about... Bro, what was the, the shit that they would do. The like, shit that they would or would not do. Like, me. they be lying. Okay, let's start off like 25K. You fight she in line? You think she'll yes. fuck for less? Yes. 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 Most yes. definitely. Yes, on God. Some yes, of these hoes that was fuck the for first a band. Re- First red flag. Mo- a lot uh, of these hoes will fuck for a band. Um, Cause they be really broke. I think some other things I heard. Um, you fucking for free. Like- my mama, most of y'all already fucking for the free. If a nigga whipped out a band, you let me and five of my whole boys do it. Mm-hmm. But I feel like that's the type of hoes you fucking with, though. No, no not, bro. That's, bro. No, I'm married. I'm okay, so what's, you. okay, if you had to put the type of hoes, like the type of hoes you fuck with on a grading scale, A, B, C, D, or F, what you giving them? B's. B, yeah. B's? B's. Have you ever fucked some C's? Yep. Hey, you ever fucked the F? No. Hey, you ever fucked the D? No. No. Hey, you ever fucked the D? I've got my dick sucked by D's. Yeah, I will say that about him. I get my dick sucked a Me, lot. No. Like. Okay, so what is that? Like, what is that like kink for you? I feel like I just like, like a kink. I like to get point. my dick sucked. Like, why? I'm, personally, I don't know. I like I like head. I don't need the fuck. I don't need sex. Okay, so can I tell you what, like what it sounds like to me? Okay. So I ain't gonna lie. Okay, you're actually like muster. I thought you was fat. I don't know. I thought you was fat for the longest. I just thought, no, oh, TJ's fat. Like, I didn't know. He bitch. used to be fat. I, though. I, when I first met you, were you not fat? No, hell no. Nah. When, oh. when you first met me, I was actually yeah, skinny. This, oh yeah, it's I had six right? yeah, yeah, You, you didn't got bigger. I got okay, bigger. so in my head, I was okay. Maybe because he fat. Okay, nah, so you're not fat, nah. right? So I'm just thinking like. It give me like well, people who say that shit, I be like, oh, they just lazy as fuck. They just be tired when they fuck. Oh, I like, I'm good at sex for real, for real. Oh, it do give me like you fat as fuck. And you don't want to have sex. No, I'm. I don't like to have sex when I don't like to have sex. I personally am not a. I'm not a fuck. I don't like to fuck all the time. But 
If you my girl, fuck, let's so rock. So do you like eggs? Because as you like to fuck a lot, Kyron, do you like eggs? Because um, ain't no way hell. Two minutes, you was already fucking. <laughs> that means you don't do foreplay. Yeah, I do. You eat pussy? Yeah. All the time? Yeah. Oh, Bitch. You chicken lying. You lying now? Wait, I'm saying. <laughs> you I, eat pussy? Yeah. I don't eat eggs. I don't eat pussy like that. But it, my, it, it, my it, girl, it, it, my, it, 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 no, and when I'm in a relationship, I eat pussy for my own liking. I eat pussy all the time. You give me asshole. I'm not gonna lie. I eat ass. Everything you saying is very like thing. asshole, like during sex. Shit. First of all, the whole head statement is very like, like how you telling the bitch? Like, are you if you not eating pussy, but you sucking your dick? How you telling the bitch that shit? No, like I before you even come over to me, I'm gonna let you know I'm we're not fucking. We're but I feel like you can tell people that shit and they don't believe that shit. But I be dead ass. Yeah, because I don't believe. We that don't shit. be we don't be fucking. I ain't gonna lie. I'm the type of nigga. I'm gonna say like we not fucking. I know damn why I want to fuck. But I'm you. I'm dead ass. Don't be fucking. Like I swear to God. I don't know about all that. I really don't be fucking. So what's the quickest y'all ever nutted? Don't lie. Five minutes. All right. For sure. Kyle, let's. About a three. About three minutes. You was embarrassed? Huh? You was embarrassed? No. Why does Tennessee say like rum? Because you mixing. Mm-mm. Why would I be embarrassed to nut fast? Like, Like, I'm not going to lie. This is the reason that I cut back on fucking because I don't like fucking a long time. I fuck for a long time now. Like, I can't nut in less than... But it get boring in sex sometimes. Okay, I really feel like, okay, so maybe that's just because my situation, but I feel like sex really like lasts longer than 30 minutes. It like, does. Yeah, for like, sure. So I feel like when y'all be like, oh, I can't do that for 30 minutes, or I got a nub for 30 minutes, like, I feel like, no. When people like, okay, how long sex should last y'all? I believe, I ain't least, gonna lie, 45, 45 to, an to an hour. hour and a half. It, depending on, like, Especially if I'm foreplaying. Like, yeah. I'm the type of nigga, I'm a, I'm a foreplay, fuck, get out, you know what I'm saying, eat you out. Kiss on you a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I feel like fuck I again. hate when I fuck fucking again. look. No real nigga shit. I hate when motherfucking sex be like straight up, just like after we do the first, we be fucking, fucking, fucking. A lot of people can we stop, bitch? Like, can we? People don't know that. People don't know that. Sex for real, bro. People don't know how to have sex for real. Like they don't understand that sex is not just about you. Like honestly, you gotta make that shit fun. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Make them. I ain't gonna lie. I like. You know, I got question for What? That's weird. I'm too tall for that. Yeah. I am. I'm honestly too tall for that. I mean, that is true. I'm too tall for a lot of shit. I can't reach I'm too tall for a lot of shit. I'm like 69 for sure. I'm for tall for a lot of shit. I'm the type of nigga. I like, like the, I can, Car I sex like, was not my thing ever. I put like... I like picking You give me something you still like car sex. Huh? You give me something you still like car sex. I'm too big for it. You too big for it? Yeah. I like car sex. I hate car sex. He do car sex. I don't. I don't. I done had sex on the tailgate. Before. What the fuck is the tailgate? Like the back of a truck. Like you let the back down. Let the bed of the truck. Oh, the tailgate. Yeah, the truck. I'm thinking the Park bench, park slide. Yeah, park, park slide, slide for sure. For sure. Yeah. Damn, for every sure. nigga. <laughs> <laughs> we just like park slide for sure, yeah. For sure, sure. Okay, so, okay, so my motherfucking statement is, okay, then what the fuck I'm finna ask you? We talked about motherfucking sex. Oh, I got a question for y'all. So, you know, you asked me before you got here, and I'm just talking to y'all, because, you know, y'all like my brothers. Y'all like my little brothers. Okay, so, basically, you know, I've been talking to this little bitch lately. Okay. And I got feelings for her, yeah. Ooh. And I ain't gonna lie, y'all, you're fucking my head up. Y'all, 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 I was sad behind a female. That fucked my head up. You? But, yeah, right? Like, what? I don't know what's going on. Like, y'all, I, I haven't been talking to no other than, like, nobody else. That's crazy. Girl. And she loved me for me. Oh. So, yeah, when I go to heaven, it's me. Hi. Okay, anyway, so, <laughs> uh, basically, I feel like this, y'all, but I be scared to fuck that hoe. Why? Why? Because I'm scared of pussy. Scared so like when like I want y'all to explain to me like what does pussy feel to y'all like when y'all like that first get that no be, no y'all just give warm. me a little it feel good it gotta be like, warm like that warm. shit gotta feel like home for your dick like that shit feels warm and comfortable mm-hmm. when okay you well you know home. I ain't never like but it gotta had be, a home so. it gotta be wet like you know what I'm saying trust me you gonna know but wait wait we done had this discussion too that uh, dry pussy has made me come yeah too dry hard. pussy do make it's you come fast it's because it grip your skin like, yeah they make you come faster. Dry pussy. Dryer pussy. Yeah. But so what do y'all prefer? Dry pussy? I mean, I prefer... A little bit in the middle. Yeah. A little bit in the middle. I need to have some grip to it. But the wet pussy, that shit that takes shit, fucking long yeah, time. Yeah, that shit take forever for you to nut. Because you be going in and out of that motherfucker. I ain't gonna lie, though. So, like, I ain't gonna lie. Like, but I, real nigga, I'm very interested in fucking this house. Like, I'm very excited to, like, get the chance to fuck this house. Like, this house is offered, but it be like, damn, bitch, I'm scared. Like, oh, my God. You gonna go crazy. Gonna go crazy I'm scared. Bro. This is what I'm scared of. My friend reminded me, this one made me scared, right? We was talking out, said all this shit. She was like, you know, you get the hell pregnant. I forgot I get people pregnant. You know, I've been, I've been gay for so long. I forgot. Like, damn, I get the hell pregnant. Like, I for, that's got me scared. Like, cause I I ain't gonna lie, like, I feel like when I fuck that I don't wanna go in the condom. I don't wanna go in the condom the first time. I feel like that shit gonna feel so good. Wait, so you it's don't gonna, use a condom? If I fuck that I'm not using no condom. I feel like for, I feel like for my first time. You, you, I'm talking you, about no, with the do boys. Do you use condoms with the niggas? Yeah. 
Okay. Just started recently. I like, just I was looking at you. Like this year, yeah, I ain't gonna lie, yeah. Just started, yeah. yeah like no, like, like me and my friend, like we're next shot open up. Like me and my friend basically went through this little process. like I wouldn't fuck with a condom, and like I had like kind of like. Just how to realize, like, bitch, I'm out here like rolling the dice on my life, and now I just stop doing that shit. So I'm condom for sure. I'm a condom ass bitch for sure. Now that's also added to the point where I don't be fucking them up. Like y'all, I ain't tell you like, I even you noticed in the episodes I stopped saying I'm a hoe because really try to realize like my hoe behavior was in college. Like I really ain't did shit. So like yeah, like that's I crazy. Like, like, we don't hear too much about you, bro. Oh, cause I was fucking bumming people. Now he calling my people. Uh, oh, that was live. Yes. Oh my god. Proud. Why you think I was white nigga MCS was so open to bum on people? Shit, I know y'all, yeah, bitch. <laughs> y'all hey, my bro, I, can't, I can't get hey, into the hey, bum on people. You sleep. Bro. Hey, bro. First of all, the females about the females, 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 females are so much. Oh, God. Oh, God. Y'all sleep. Chairs, but it's when they pop out. When like, I worked at Cheddar's, I worked at Cheddar's for like three weeks. When I worked there, bro, I told these niggas all the time, I would see so many bad hoes. I'd be like, because I've never seen these hoes. And like, they'll come in every day. I'd be like, bro, these bitches bad around bum on. But shit, they don't just they don't go outside. But, but they give me set up vibes out there. Though. Facts, they do give me set up vibes. I don't motherfucking know. But anyways, I want to play a motherfucking voicemail for y'all and shit like that, cause you know we're in the motherfucking afters already. And I got two motherfucking voicemails I want y'all to motherfucking listen to and yeah. shit like that. So let me get y'all motherfucking hot and motherfucking ready. Boop 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 boop. All right, take a shot. All right, so here we go with the first one. Ba da ba da ba ba ba. Let me make sure this is the right one. <laughs> Alright, I'll play this one. So it's not the one I had earlier, but fuck it. Hey, what's up, man? I just want to say that um, I'm masculine. Um, <clears throat> I'm chubby bear and like. I'm a black male, and, like, I love your content, dude. It's fucking awesome. Um, but a topic I would love to see you touch on is, you know, like, sort of dating and, and actually, like, sex in the courses. Um, I was discovered that like, a lot of, like, guys in the black community that kind of stray away from interracial play. And it's like, uh, we need, like, touch more on, like, on why and the roots of that. Um, we definitely certainly have our reasons, but, you know, I feel like we all need to explore more. But how do you feel on that? Um, Nigga, you know why. Wait, we scared as hell. Wait, he said interracial dating, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not against interracial dating. I am. Uh, Don't let that white I bitch put you I in jail. I wouldn't marry a white girl, but I would mess with one. For sure. Let that white bitch put you in jail. So I, like I mean, time, not like I all white like, girls like that, though. Yeah, but like, why they, you want to roll your dice and figure but out what they daddies, But they daddies do. But you going to know, bro. You going to know. But they daddies be like that. Fuck that. Yeah, yeah, I feel like a lot I, time, I, what did I, I tell you? When you show me the picture of that white girl and her daddy and her family, I said her daddy look like she, he want to say nigga. And you know it. Yeah, but she didn't say nigga. So I feel like the reason why people don't date outside their race is like a lot of like the past things that we deal with, right? And I feel like at the end of the day, like we're more comfortable with our race. Think about how like every school kept the motherfucking set. It's black people here, white people here. I don't mm -hmm. know how it is now, but black people here, white people here. Everything is segregated automatically. Out. We just click to our own people. So I don't think it's nothing about like being against white people and things like that or being and against Mexicans. I can't bring like a white person home. I can't bring a white girl home. Yeah, it's kind of hard to bring somebody over you different because your whole family will kind of be like, oh, yeah. It's like yeah. my grandparents really had to deal with like segregation and things like that, right? So it's kind of hard to be like, grandma, first of all, this is my gay white husband. The fuck? Like, <laughs> yeah, how I'm explaining that shit? <laughs> oh, my mama, they're going to ask so many My grandma going to scream and die right there. She going to just die. I feel, I feel like no. it go back to people not being more. Like, I'm okay, so those people are not multicultural. We're yeah. multicultural, so I feel like to us, it's kind of like reality. Y'all, I wouldn't talk to, I wouldn't, my purpose is not to talk to a Caucasian person, right? But I would talk to a Hispanic, I would talk to an Asian, I would talk to an Indian. Facts, I'll talk to them. Yeah, I'm really into that. I don't care. So I just feel like everything else, like when it comes to Caucasians, I ain't gonna lie, just, I, it could Stay be just, I'm mm -hmm. just not for it. So was, know, especially because I was a freshman, I went to UIW and it was nothing white people. But now, no, that, San Antonio, white people and Mexicans. What is UIW? University in Carnival. I just want to piss you off again. <laughs> Yeah. Now it's like a, um, it's like you see a lot of athletes dating white girls, but I feel like it's I do only it, like I a. Feel like it'll be publicity. Yeah, I feel like niggas nah, do that for security. It don't be. It don't niggas do that shit for security. Yeah. I think. Nah, what you mean? It's security? a phase that you go through. Nah, I ain't going through that phase. A lot of dudes go through that phase, I especially guess. in high school. Next fucking question. Uh, uh, what was this? Um, I just saw you on TikTok and I see you had a phone number. This gives me like mom's behavior, social boy vibes. 
Is this your personal? Um, I hope you have a good day. It's a special day today. Poo, 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 However me poo. Um, yeah, like you should put me on one of your little podcast interviews. I would really love that. But you can give me like a call back or maybe like a text or something. That's no. 470-304-4176. I'm going to text It's your girl, Sydney. <laughs> <laughs> have a good one. Oh, uh, hey girl. I think you said her name was Brittany or Sydney. What's up, Brittany? Hey girl. What's Shit, up? what's up? If you want to come to the motherfucking podcast, just hit me. Just hit us. See what yeah. it's My about. man, Mary, for that. But to come to the motherfucking yeah. podcast, because your, your voice name was on this episode, you got to buy some spade motherfucking clothing. Hey, for if sure. you don't get on no motherfucking gear, you can't come to the motherfucking spade podcast. Clothing. That's what I'm saying. Spade clothing Spadeclothingbrand.com on Instagram, Spade Clothing Brand on Twitter, Spade Clothing One. All right, cool. And what's y'all personal Instagrams? Uh, Kyron.nd. TJ. The runner underscore cool period. All right, well, anyways, before we wrap it up, I'm gonna take a motherfucking shot. You know, I gotta take a motherfucking shot before you wrap this motherfucking thing up. Right. You should not have nothing in your cup, so if you do, that means you never took them shots. I did take it. All right, all right, all right. They're gonna be blaming us. All right, <laughs> all right, so there go that baby. All right, so anyways, y'all, thank you for tapping to the motherfucking After Zardy podcast. I appreciate you. You was here for the motherfucking premiere of the episode. I really do like your episode. I enjoyed y'all for real, for real. So, yeah, I do. did y'all enjoy y'all time? Go no, for review. sure. Yeah, yeah, all right. Definitely. Appreciate y'all. So, yeah. So, anyways, thank you for tapping to the motherfucking podcast. If you was not here for the premiere, make sure you start watching at 8 o'clock. Don't take your shot yet. Make sure you watch at 8 p.m., y'all, and make sure you start watching Premier because I'll be live chatting every night, and I get on live right after with random people and things like that, and I talk about all different types of topics that may lead up to my topics for the next episode. So make sure you all tap right, in and things like that. All right, so let's take our motherfucking shot. Make sure you tap in, follow, like, and subscribe. Follow my partners right here. Follow me, of course, as well. Answer my daily questions. And yeah, I know it's a whole lot of shit that comes with Zardy, but trying to make sure y'all have fun with me. So, arriba. Take the shot. All right, y'all. Good night. Say good night, Dan. I'll be free. Good night. Good night, y'all. Y'all have a cool one. Good night to the people. <laughs> That's it. I don't know way to the party. Excuse us for the tardy. Had to pick up a Mari and cop some Bacardi. Bought tennis boys some shots. So I'm starting to get high. You ain't the five, bitch. I think night. You can't stand in this spot. Oh, I hope to the DJ This a song you finna play Let me grab that mic Oh, I'm feeling right Ain't no worries, ain't no stress tonight We a little drunk, so be polite Staring at me, oh, what a light I guess you got some stage fright DJ, turn these lights on loud Come and meet me on the dance floor Play something nice and slow So DJ, turn these lights on loud Meet me on a dance floor Play something nice and slow We gon' go all night We gon' go all night Don't care we do it right Who cares we do it right We gon' live our life We gon' live our life I ain't no sleep tonight I ain't no sleep tonight You on the dance floor And you feeling yourself You trying to let me know What you all about Trying to figure me out Talking about you on the one down at 69 The club clubs I had to I leaving my friends for you What you really trying to do I'm not really good at taboo Dancing for too long I like ping pong, so before the night ain't wrong, better make a move on this song. So DJ, turn these lights on low, come and meet me on the dance floor, play something nice and slow. So DJ, turn these lights on low, come and meet me on the dance floor, play something nice and slow. We gon' go all night, we gon' go all night, don't care we do it right, who cares we do it right. Tonight. We gon' go all night, we gon' go all night Don't care we do it right, cause we do it right We gon' live our life, we gon' live our life